Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I got another package in the mail, so let's get right into it. This is another box, guys, that is too big to fit in the frame, so I am sorry, but I will open it right now. I can try to fit it in frame like this, but I don't think I can. I, yeah, I can't fit it in the frame normally, so I'll open it like this, but... Um, might be a little difficult. Let me just pop it over this side so I can put it open. There we go. I'm going to put it up right now because of the packing peanuts. I don't want those to fall out. Okay, some of these cars are wrapped in, um, in paper here. So this one is wrapped in paper and so is this one so we'll save those two for last um the first one i'm pulling out here oh we got christopher bell's 2021 um dewalt car this is the first dewalt car i've gotten since i believe 2017 it's the first one i've gotten since 2017 so that is really darn cool now let's take the, a look at the next one in the box um Next one in the box is going to be Brad Keselowski's Money Lion car. Another beautiful paint scheme. My first ever Money Lion car, apart from the um, championship one that Austin Sindrick had from last year. But I don't count that one because it has the dumb championship logo on the top. It's definitely another good one. One of the last Brad Keselowski Penske cars that will probably ever be made. Next up, looks like we got another Brad Keselowski car in his Team Penske Auto Trader car. Um, another great paint scheme. I don't, this is my, um, first ever Auto Trader paint scheme that is in this style. I have, um, his other one that is in this style. So I do have this one, but it's a completely different paint scheme. And I've been wanting one of the Mustang Auto Trader cars for a while, so now I have one. Next up, it looks like we got, uh, packages damaged on this one a bit. This kind of sucks because I was, this is one that I was really looking forward to. Right here we have Daniel Suarez's number 99 iFly car. have this one in the Authentics in a package on my wall, so this is another nice one to get. Might have to clean it up with some rubbing alcohol, but this is another great car. Another great one to add to your collection since iFly will not be sponsoring him and he anymore, and they only sponsored him a little bit last year, so this is another great car. Now let's take a look at these ones that we have wrapped up here. Um, let me unravel this one. Oh, looks like this is going to be Kurt Busch's gear wrench car. Um, another beautiful scheme that I have in the Authentics, but it's in the package right now, so... Actually, no, I don't have this one in the Authentics yet. Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. It's right there. I do have that one in the Authentics. But I haven't opened it because I want to keep the Authentics one in the box, but I'm going to use this one for the ZNC Cup Series. So that is another great one. Ooh, Chase Elliott's A-Shot car. Wow, 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 wow. I always like to pinch the edges here. I don't know why. It makes it, like, you see, especially with the Brad Keselowski one, you see how it's kind of, like, rounded there? I like it when it's, like, I don't know, kind of more squared off. You see my different the difference there? Yeah, so if you guys ever get this, I don't know, just make it, it'll make it fit in better with the rest of your cars. Just kind of reshape it back into like the square shape that it's supposed to be i don't know why i do that i guess it's just, it's just kind of been a habit since i've gotten this one. Oh, and the blisters ah the blister i might have another blister to put it in fortunately but thank you guys for watching this video make sure you comment like and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time goodbye